Good afternoon and welcome to Carol's Universe Tarot Readings, Tarot Readings from the Heart. So today I have your Love and Romance reading for October 2014 for the Zodiac sign of Libra. So Librans, the card that I pulled, just to let you know how I work this, um, I'm going to be doing love readings as well as your general overall reading for a month. Uh, with the love readings I only pull one card, with the general readings I usually pull eight. So the one card that I pulled for you guys in terms of your love and romantic life during the month of October 2014 was the Knight of Cups. And what a beautiful card to pull, especially for you single Librans. So the Knight of Cups is a really sort of gentle, kind, caring individual. Um, the depiction of the Knight of Cups on this card is, I mean, I'm not using the Rider Waite pack at the moment. I'm using another pack of tarots. But it usually depicts someone coming in uh, on a white horse with and offering a cup. Um, so it's it's almost like a messenger with news, somebody giving you news, someone um, basically telling you something. And I think that what this card means for you guys during the month of October is you're going to have new love coming in. I really believe that you're going to have new love coming in for some of you Librans. And I believe it's going to be someone who treats you really, really well. The knight on shine, in shining armour. The someone who comes to your rescue. The someone who you know, sweeps in and swoops off your feet and makes you feel absolutely amazing. The Knight of Cups uh, is also depicted as being someone who just absolutely loves falling in love. They really like the romance of it. They love the whirlwind of it. They love all that good stuff. So I think for you guys that uh, single Librans, that it could be a case of that this person um, that comes into your life potentially in October is really just going to give you an amazing time. You're just going to have such a romantic time with them and you're just going to feel really wanted and really loved and they're just going to be an absolute uh, spectacular suitor. Now as the cup suit is off the water element, this person that potentially comes into your life could either be uh, a Pisces, a Cancer or a Scorpio. Okay, so watch out for that. Also, for Librans embarking on a new relationship, so if you've just entered a new relationship now, there is the potential for beautiful, committed love to blossom during the month of October. For you uh, Librans who are all already in a, uh, in a relationship with someone, this card really just says that the relationship could actually deepen even further, so you could get more commitment, there could be for example, proposals, um, there could be potentially marriages, so for some of you, you'll possibly be getting engaged. Um, also, it does warn, though, that if you're spending too much time um, away from your partner, too much time focusing your energies on other things, for example, work or friends or family, then you really just need to type, take the time out and devote more time to your partner, strengthen that relationship, make yourselves feel you know committed again really get back to the way that things were when you first met to that you know first flushes of love and yeah it's, it's a really really good card for both singles and people in a relationship so I would say that in terms of your love readings um, Librans that this is a really really good month for you just in terms for single people potentially hoping for a new romance to come in. I definitely say for some of you Librans, you're going to have someone comes in, sweeps you off your feet. You're not going to know where you are. You're going to be feeling really giddy and really kind of lightheaded about love. It's going to be a very romantic experience for you. Um, I can't say whether it's going to last or not in terms of if you do meet someone new in October. Um, but all I know is that during the experience, you're going to have an absolutely wonderful time. And for those of you that are embarking on a new relationship, just getting involved with someone um, right now, that there is the potential for absolute real love to blossom. So, yeah, really, really good month for you. Also, to let you know, guys, that I do, at the end of this video, um, offer a message card from my The Romance angels oracle cards and this is the Doreen Virtue pack it's filled with 44 oracle cards and what I'm going to do now I'm going to shuffle those cards and I'm going to pick out a card for you just to serve as a message from your angels for the month of October about your love life so let's have a look this is the deck so I'm just going to shuffle this right now
I try not to spend too much time shuffling, but usually when I've done a, a reading prior to this, I like to kind of get them shuffled. Oops, one's just fallen on the floor. Oh, one just fell out, so I'm going to use this one. Soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. What a wonderful card to have for you, Librans. So let's have a look at what Doreen Virtue says about soulmates in your message card for the month of October. Let's have a look for you. Let's just get to the page. Okay, you chose this card because you wonder if a certain person is your soulmate and the answer is yes. As we all do, we have many soulmates, beings with whom you share a mystical soul connection and life path. Soulmates incarnate with the plan of coming together for mutual spiritual and personal growth. As you suspected, the person you're inquiring about is one of yours. That sense of familiarity and comfort you felt when you first met also indicates your soulmate bond. This card sometimes comes to those who ask, when will I meet my soulmate or will I ever meet my soulmate? It's validation that this will occur. Many times this is a person whom you already know, although romantic sparks didn't fly at first, you'll have another opportunity to explore passion together. That's a wonderful card to have. So I think that what this card is saying is that for you Librans who are already in a committed relationship, that this person is potentially your soulmate and that the, that the relationship has uh, the potential to deepen even further in October, potentially maybe with a proposal or maybe with a trip away or maybe, you know, with an eternity ring or whatever it may be. Uh, but I definitely think for some of you Librans, you have the potential in October for your love to deepen even further. And for you single Librans, I think that this card just really indicates that potentially in the month of October, that with meeting someone, that person potentially could be your soulmate. And for those of you Librans who are embarking on a new relationship with someone, so someone that you already know, someone who you've probably been with for maybe a month or, you know, a couple of weeks or a couple of months, then that person could potentially be your soulmate um, going forward. So, guys, I hope that you enjoyed that reading and I will see you in the week. I'll be starting my angel readings for the week for the zodiac sign of Libra as well as other zodiac signs. So I'll see you there. Take care.